And that, that leads me to uh, turn to uh, our friends from uh, startups. Because very often, uh, definitely when we hear how promising your solutions are, we can't wait to have them um, scale in terms of production and adopted widely. So what do you see, I'm turning to you, Livia, what do you see, if, if you had a wish list, uh, do you see any uh, regulatory uh, feature that could help you on that path? If you had asked only what is my wish list, I would say just money. We just need more money. <laughs> um, but on regulations, um, I like what Thierry said in the morning, if I understood correctly. He said, um, real, realism uh, at short term and uh, idealism in the long term. So in the short term, um, I hope that's what he said. Um, forgive me if not. From, oh, it was. Good. good. Um, so for us, it's it's also uh, kind of around um, the way the regulations are. So we are trying to implement a new technology in an industry that has been around for 2,000 years, of a technology that has been around for, what, 20 years, 30 years. So we are talking about a tr time frame of 1%. So it takes time, and it should take time, because what we want is our, that our infrastructure, it's very safe first and foremost is safety of everybody involved. Um, but right now, to implement a new technology um, on a construction, and we have a case uh, working with um, a company in the UK as well, it takes time. We need a, um, a deviation from standard, and it, it takes departure from um, standard, sorry. Um, and it can take from a few weeks all the way to a couple of years. So I think uh, what we are doing right now is to liaising with um, organs in the UK that are responsible for the standardization of our products. But in the long term, the vision that we have is that the codes can be changed to consider that technology. And there are other um, self-healing um, cementitious materials company there up and running. And um, what I envision in a way is that in maybe 10 years or 20 years, you're going to see the changes in the Euro code. And it's going to say, well, using traditional cement, that's the amount, that's the guideline for it. Using self-healing cementitious materials, that's the guideline for it. And I think that's going to be speed up our process quite a lot. So uh, prescriptive, yeah. prescriptive regulation, yeah. uh, you would call uh, for.